has one final case to meet. A man that has taken physiology to new levels. Stig Severinsen is a superhuman freediver who began swimming when he was six years old. He has achieved several world records and was the first person ever to hold his breath for over 20 minutes. To be able to hold your breath for over 20 minutes, that's really rare. And I question whether the average person could really train themselves to do that. Freediving requires consuming oxygen as slowly as possible. When diving, blood vessels constrict, lowering the heart rate and the body's need for oxygen. The lower the heart rate, the longer the breath can be held. So, ahead of today's practice dive, Heather wants to test to what degree Stig can slow his heart rate. The requirements for this are a heart rate monitor and a 100 meter dive rope. I have this heart rate monitor. Yes. Would you mind wearing this and maybe we could take your heart rate just before you go in and then just when you come up? We That's can see if there's absolutely no problem. So right now, it's in the, about the low 90s, so we'll see if it continues to drop as you go down. I'll get my suit on. OK, let's do it. For Stig's record attempt, he will pre-oxygenate. This involves inhaling pure oxygen directly before the breath hold to maximize the amount in his blood. But today, Stig is diving without additional oxygen. This makes it much harder, as his body will crave oxygen much sooner. He just went and did this lung packing thing where he just stuck his head up and started filling up his lungs. For the descent, it's vital that Stig keeps body movement to the minimum. The average person can't do this, and so the brain forces them to take a breath after about a minute. Stig has already gone 30 seconds beyond that. I can't imagine what he's feeling right now. Three minutes. By this stage, most of us would have succumbed to the uncontrollable urge to breathe. Our lungs would be full of water as the drowning process begins. It's a little nerve-wracking to just think that he's holding his breath this whole time. If you feel the weight of the time, it's... If Stig can get past four minutes here, he'll be on target for his record attempt later. 